a bill that would waive the state and local sales tax on entertainment-related activities this summer is drawing mixed reviews. The Assembly passed the bill last week, but Capitol Bureau Chief A.J. Bayapur has you covered on the opposition that's coming from one of the state's hubs for summer getaways. For June, July, and August, the bill would eliminate the sales tax at businesses related to dining and entertainment. These specific businesses that dealt with uh, entertainment, uh, restaurants, bars, taverns, coffee shops, caterers, you name it, were really hit hard when all the, all the things were basically suspended for the summer. However, a community built on attracting visitors and keeping them for an extra day or two is saying no thanks to the bill. One of the state's largest centers for amusement type attractions is Wisconsin Dells. Yet the Convention and Visitors Bureau here says it opposes the bill seeking to waive the sales tax during the summer months. The Bureau says it expects a surge in visitors this summer regardless and quote, because of this demand, we do not believe visitors will change their travel habits or be incentivized to travel simply because there is no tax being charged on some industries. The statement goes on to say, the revenue lost to counties and municipalities will be significant. Both the city of Wisconsin Dells and the village of Lake Delton have made financial commitments to maintain and improve their municipal infrastructures and rely on the premier resort tax revenue. The bill's author, Representative Pat Snyder, says money from the American Rescue Plan could fill that hole. I can see their concerns and, and uh, I would not want to see that go away, but I do know that many of the counties are receiving uh, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars coming in. In the Dells, AJ Bayapur, 27 News. The bill would cost the state an estimated $160 million in sales tax revenue. It would cost counties about $13 million. Neither Governor Evers nor leaders in the Senate have indicated whether they support the idea.